what causes that switch to flip? The overdrive, the beast mode, the full on destroyer that will not stop. So machines make their decisions based on ones and zeros. Binary code, yes or no. And that's actually a good system for you to implement for your own personal human machine. It's actually not that complicated. Are you going to work out today? Yes or no? Are you going to eat the donut? Yes or no? Are you going to win? Yes or no? Don't allow for any gray area in there. Get rid of the debate. Make the binary code decision, yes or no. You know the right decision to make. So go and make it. But what's equally pathetic is when people let that scenario play out in their own head. Too tired, too hungry, too sore, too hot, too cold, to whatever. People ask me what I do when I get those little feelings running around. Well, let me tell you what I don't do. I don't tell everybody. No, I actually just keep that to myself. As a matter of fact, I don't even let those words run around inside my own brain housing group. I keep it secure, lock it down. And instead of taking charge of the situation and taking charge of their life, they let some voice in their head that's lazy and weak and pathetic start to run things. Don't let that happen. You're in charge. It takes both emotion and logic for you to reach your match maximum potential to to really give everything you have and go beyond your limits. No matter what's happening in your life, no matter what's coming down on you, don't surrender to it. Ask yourself, what am I gonna do about this? And then go make it happen. And sometimes you're barely making any progress. Sometimes you're barely making any progress at all. That tough situation is making you want to stop. And what you eventually learn is you can't stop. When you're going through tough situations, you got to take that next step. Take action. Some things are going to happen that are not in your control. You're going to get knocked around. You got to take the same mindset. That is, hang on to your paddle, get back in your boat, and get to rowing. That's where you gotta use that anger, that frustration, that fear to push yourself harder. To push yourself to say, I don't stop. And when your feelings are screaming that you've had enough, and when you think you're gonna break emotionally, you gotta override that emotion with the concrete logic and willpower that says, you know what? I don't stop. And you won't. Life is short. So go live it.